Hello, and welcome to our short demo video of Bright Patterns integration with WeChat. We're going to take a look at the agent perspective as well as the customer perspective for the WeChat integration. I'm going to start by logging in my agent, John, and I will also initiate a WeChat conversation with my contact. I will make John ready. We've got a number of different customizable states you can use here. We can make John ready. At the same time, I'm going to make this customer say hi to this person. So you'll see some messages coming through there. I'm going to hit accept. And now I'm connected to the person on WeChat. I can see Nick's message, hi. I sent Nick back some messages, letting him know that he's connected and perhaps who he's speaking with. We popped Nick's location on a map. We can capture that from the WeChat application. We can also use predefined or canned responses here. So if we need to send that over to Nick, John can say hello in his standard greeting. Whenever he deems appropriate, he can use the disposition here. Or he could simply end the chat. We do have the option to flag as well. So if a supervisor, if, if the agent is in need of supervisor assistance, they can flag that and the supervisor will be then notified. We can also do two-way document and picture sharing through WeChat as well. So if we wanted to just send a photo over, we could simply select one and, and send that over. Then John will be able to see that, that photo as well. This is mostly driven by way of scenarios. So what a scenario is, is what happens when an interaction comes in. So you saw those messages we were sending over. We can define what those messages are. So we can say, thank you for contacting us. And then at the end of the interaction, we can say, thanks for contacting us via WeChat. So there's a number of different ways we could integrate WeChat. I hope you enjoyed this short video. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Our website is www.brightpattern.com. Thanks for watching.